Body parts women want you to touch. Pleasing a woman is an art form, one that you should always be working to grow and evolve. Here's your guide to women's favorite spots to be touched. Head scalp. If you've ever treated yourself to having your hair washed during a trim, you know just how good a scalp rub can feel. The scalp is a hotbed of nerve endings, which makes it a great erogenous zone. Ears. There's a reason why having someone whisper in your ear gives you goosebumps. Ears have several nerves that feel especially good when stimulated through both sound and touch, and that effect doubles when you're hearing the voice of someone you love. Inner Thighs What makes this spot erogenous is the sheer fact that it's positioned so close to the clitoris. Touching the area right near her most sensitive spot makes the inner thighs an ideal place to tease. Neck the phrase, breathing down your neck, usually has a negative connotation, but when the right person is dedicating their efforts to gently blowing on this extremely erogenous spot, the results can be mind-blowing. This is a highly sensual erogenous zone packed with sensitive nerve endings. The vagus nerve, filled with sensory fibers, runs along this area as well. Lips Kissing feels awesome, but you probably don't know the science behind why. When we kiss, our brains release dopamine and oxytocin, or feel-good, chemicals, and the more you kiss, the better it gets. Blood flow increases, and what was already an intense erogenous zone goes into overtime. Lower back. It's no accident that sensual dances like salsa or tango call for the man to place his hand on the woman's lower back. There are plenty of nerves in that area extending down to her buttocks. The sacral nerves in the small of your back basically have a direct line to your genitals and can trigger great pleasure when touched. Nipples The one you've all been waiting for, folks. Aside from being connected to nerves that enhance pleasure upon touch, nipple stimulation also aids women in reaching orgasm. In fact, some women can achieve climax solely through nipple play. The nipples and breasts are crucial areas during foreplay and particularly in the arousal phase of the sexual response cycle. Direct stimulation whether through gentle touching or oral stimulation, triggers the release of oxytocin, a chemical also known as the love hormone. Oxytocin plays a significant role in women's orgasms. Navel. Get ready to have your mind blown. Now that science has revealed there's much more to the structure of the clitoris than previously understood, with only a quarter of it visible, we can comprehend why sensations such as having your navel licked and touched can feel good. The clitoris and the belly button actually originate from the same tissue and are neurologically linked. In fact, some women report feeling sensations in their clitoris through their belly buttons. Clitoris Certainly, this topic is worth discussing, particularly because you may not be aware of the science behind its workings. The clitoris communicates with the brain through the pudendal nerve, which is the same pathway that carries information to the brain from the penis. It serves only one function, pleasure. With over 8,000 nerve fibers, more than twice the amount found on the head of the penis, it obviously feels really good when touched, as long as it's done the right way, of course. Feet. Don't knock it until you've tried it, as long as your partner is into it. For women, toes tend to be more sensitive than soles. Reflexologists believe that when a woman's toes are sucked or lightly pinched on the sides, it can stimulate the vagina and potentially even induce a toe-curling orgasm. 
So here are all the hidden gems when it comes to the right spots to touch your woman. We're going to start with the more subtle techniques that you can use as early as your first date with her, and then move on to the more intimate and arousing ones. Her neck. According to a psychologist, the neck is an incredibly potent and rich erogenous zone. Kissing and licking her neck can drive many women crazy with desire for more. Many women also really enjoy having the back of their neck massaged with your fingers, as it feels incredibly relaxing, arousing, and just so good. Her sternum. Yes, breasts are wonderful and a lot of fun to play with, but have you ever thought about touching and stroking the area between them? Running your fingers from her neck down through her sternum can feel incredibly arousing and enjoyable for her. Her hair. Run your hands through her hair like a comb, she will enjoy the comfort that simple gesture brings her. It's an immensely pleasurable experience that is bound to put her in the mood. It will make her feel pampered and cared for. Rub your hands on her pelvis gently. The pelvis is a great area to stimulate because it's so close to her vagina. The suspense of being so near yet so far will drive her crazy. According to psychologists, before you know it, she'll be begging you to touch her there. Touch the inside of her thighs. It's also very close to her vagina, and she'll enjoy the tease. Don't be afraid to take your time as you caress the inside of her thighs. Her clit. Rather than focusing solely on penetration or clitoral stimulation, try grinding against your man's thigh or engaging in some good old-fashioned dry humping. This way, you can stimulate your pubic mound and much more of your clitoris than usual. It can work just as well with your clothes on as off. Devote more time to her breast instead of moving to those obvious sex parts of her body. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.